Daniel, D-A-N-I-E-L, last name is Curry, C-U-R-R-Y. I work for the Los Angeles Fire Department as a captain. What happened this morning, Captain? Okay, this morning uh, at uh, approximately 4.45 a.m., uh, we responded to a, a structure fire in the Van Nuys area. Uh, when we arrived on scene, we had a single family dwelling with a detached garage in the back. Uh, this detached garage was on fire. Uh, there had been a, an attempted rescue of an individual that lives in this detached garage, which has been converted to a living space. Uh, the gentleman that tried to rescue the occupant uh, was overcome by the heat and smoke and had to abandon the rescue. Uh, we discovered uh, what became a fatality after we extinguished the fire. Uh, the gentleman that attempted uh, the rescue was transported to a local hospital. Uh, it took us 13 minutes to uh, bring this fire under control and knock it down. Uh, we, we don't have an estimate of damage at this time. Uh, we do have arson on scene and uh, they are uh, investigating the cause of the fire at this time. Any idea where the fire originated in this detached garage? Do you have any idea um, where or how it started? It, it appears to be in what is now a bedroom. Uh, the garage has been converted to uh, multiple rooms. Uh, there does appear to be the most fire damage in the bedroom, uh, which is where the occupant was and uh, where the uh, attempted rescue began. What can you tell us about the victim, age? Uh, the, uh, the victim is a, approximately a 50 to 55 year old male. We hear that it may have started with a candle. Are you hearing anything from residents uh, as regards to that? We understand that has been determined because of arson. Are you hearing anything? That... I haven't heard anything. Uh, arson uh, is doing their investigation. They are talking with uh, the other residents of this property. They're also talking with witnesses from across the street. The first call for this incident came uh, from the uh, two-story apartment building that's across the street on the south side of Victory Boulevard. Can you tell us, um, was the fire contained only to that garage or did it spread? It did, uh, it did spread to a uh, fifth wheel uh, detached uh, type of RV that is uh, parked behind uh, the single family dwelling and it's directly west of the converted garage. Uh, a part of that uh, did eventually catch on fire. Uh, the two occupants of that motor home uh, slash uh, fifth wheel uh, were not injured. Oh wow, so there's people living in that RV yes. as well. Yes. So can you, there's also a lot of animals that came out. Were any animals killed? Or I don't have any reports of animals uh, injured or killed. And we also heard bystanders came in to try and uh, help folks in this home. Do you, do you have any Well, the, uh, the one uh, person that did attempt to rescue the uh, deceased individual uh, came from the front house. He lives in the front house. Uh, there were also other uh, uh, people that were attempting to put the fire out with garden hoses. I'm not aware of the, whether they lived on the property or they came from adjacent properties. Can you just tell us, you know, obviously, was there any smoke alarms? And if there was not a smoke alarm in that detached garage, what's the message really here? Well, we do, we do have a uh, smoke alarm that was present in the bedroom. Uh, we don't know if it was operable. Uh, the message here would be that even if you have smoke alarms, they do need to be tested monthly. Uh, if they're battery operated, you need to change the batteries every six months. But you should be uh, testing those. Uh, we prefer that they be hardwired. And there are also uh, types that you can buy now. And you don't have to change the batteries for them. They last 10 years. You also need a carbon monoxide detector. So uh, some type of combination of those two type of alarms is, is uh, preferable. Uh, but uh, there is a smoke alarm that is present, but we're at this time we can't determine whether it operated or not. Thank you, Thank so you much. sir. I appreciate your time. You're welcome. Is the